have such sights to show you. What the hell did you guys just make me watch? Well, coming into this, not going to lie, I was a little excited. Yeah, I have never. What's <laughs> sick, what's sick, everybody, is not only did I ask you guys if you wanted me to review this, which is why I'm reviewing it on Twitter. Thanks. Thanks a lot, Twitter. Yeah. Uh, and uh, But I asked Joe and Alex, and I have never seen either of these two as excited to go to a film, not even for Star Wars, Rise of the Skywalker, where they're this excited. You're sick. Mm -hmm. You're sick I've people. I've heard so man many bad things about this. I was like, I have to we see have this We have to see it. It's a cultural myself. event. Oh, my <laughs> God. Guys, why, why did you make me just do that? That was... Why? That was it was, that was a hellish fever dream nightmare fuel mm. and it just would not stop. I was like what is happening? Why is there no plot? Everybody just sings their names and what they do. It's an introduction. Yeah. They, they'll, it's introduction the film and then it just ends they kill the cat at the end. <laughs> I'm like, wh why the do. cat people like this? And everybody moves like this. It's a weird gyrating. and The CGI is so bad. The if head is love, just going. Man. This CGI is but real bad. Bad. Is this what you wanted? Hmm? Is this what you want? <laughs> is that what you want? Chat, uh, YouTube comments. Uh, is that what you wanted to see? Probably. Well, you got it. I had to go through this film and I was like, start singing already because they'll stare at each other along. There were some awkward pauses. And I was like, just fucking sing. <laughs> and, and then when they started uh, singing, I was like, just fucking stop singing. Yeah. <laughs> um, damn if you do, damn I, if you don't. I know. have no idea Did you how Cats is so popular after having seen this. This is my first experience well, actually, with cats. Um, I don't. I don't know anything about the Broadway other than it was creepy. Mm -hmm. Did you see the Broadway? I skipped yeah. it because I don't like cats. But you like musicals. Yeah, I love musicals. See, I have a problem with musicals. They have to be really good for me to there's like a lot, them. There's a lot of good ones. And there's some good ones. This I will admit. This is not. This is not one of them. One of them. But you've seen. I've seen. You, I've, cats isn't my favorite musical. Not. I. I I think the cats is kind of boring and weird and out there for me. Okay. There's like uh, Memory is a great song. Everyone, everyone loves Memory, and they did a good job. I don't with love Memory. Well, yeah. Well. Granted, it is stuck in my head right now. Yeah, you were just singing. I yeah. It damn that that song gets stuck, but I did not really like yeah. it. Uh, it's not my thing. I tell you, there are two parts that I did like out of this whole <laughs> fucking film. I'm like morbidly curious because there's some weird <laughs> things, and I'm hoping that you're not going to oh, say what. Oh no, hell no. There is so. This Creepy, was honestly weird. just a nonstop cringe fest. It felt like yeah, it, it was, was someone's fetish thing that I just don't get. It Ugh. was like, it's like, am I supposed I to like? That. I don't <laughs> like this. Like, why? Sybil, what's the the girl's name? The fat cat, Rebel. Uh, Rebel. Rebel also. Sybil is over here, Rebel like literally <laughs> playing with her pussy, and I'm talking about the cat. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> no. She's literally she's scratching it's her a, crotch and she's splitting her legs, and I'm like, "Oh, get me out of the theater!" It's terrible. Bad, bad touch, bad look. Oh my mm. God, what did uh. we just watch? And then we had a CGI floating face. Yeah, it was and bad. then the and then there's these mice that are like, they were, the cockroaches were, were terrifying. <laughs> 
there's, there's a platoon of cockroaches, and I'm like, I what? Hate I cockroaches. have no idea what is happening. Hate and there's fucking magic, and there's fucking. I like the magic. <laughs> ridiculous. Yeah. There was not enough magic. Okay, I, they would have so won me over with the magic. I'm going to say, uh, kind of some interesting looking sets. I guess what they were trying to do. Is make the cats look like the size of real house cats. Yeah. But it, I don't know. Some of it was consistent and some of it wasn't. Oh, yeah. there was a lot of. I was like, what is going on? Otherwise, I would like it. I like the street that they're on with all the, the, the neon lights mm. in the background. But everything else, seeing you know, these actors, seeing Gandalf as uh, as a cat yes. and go meow 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 meow. <laughs> I was like, what are you doing? Like, yeah, have you been reduced to this? Yeah, he caught up a hairball on a guy, and that's how he... <laughs> he sounded like the cowardly lion. Gandalf! Meow, meow, meow. Somebody needs to intercut these things. No. Because I was like, what is going on? What type of person really goes to the theater and enjoys this? It's so... Over the top, cringe fat. Like everybody wow. has to dance and move like this. Actually, I know one person that would love it. <laughs> that, yes. <laughs> Yeah. That's basically what cats is. That's that that it, that was the whole film. Yes. Why did you make me do this? Alex, what the fun. fuck happened? So there are jellicles. Do we do we do a spoiler section for this? This this is a show that came out 30 years ago based on like a 100-year-old weird poem. Okay. So I don't no think there's spoiler like spoiler section. No. We're we're go- if you do if you don't want it spoiled then don't wa- I don't know. No one's gonna go it's see. Fine. Yeah. Don't look. Don't watch. Well, it. What the hell happened? Uh, don't so watch like, it. there's all of these jellical cats, which I'm pretty sure they're like in purgatory, and then they're trying. Well, every year they get together and they try. One gets voted to ascend to like heaven, their version of he- heaven. So it's this is terrible. all terrible. It's fantasy, whimsical. It's weird. not supposed to be. Look, these are real alley cats, and they're in the streets of London somewhere. Yeah. No, it's. It's like fantasy. It's all heaven and hell and the battle between evil and good. No. <laughs> no, yeah, not, not, not that interesting. Got, and then one gets, one gets so voted to... you look like a mouse, not a cat. So I you tried. do the little singing mouse section. Oh, you're the mouse. Man, I don't know. The, do, I, do the I'm jazz hands. I'm trying to hands. block it out. Joe, jazz hands. Jazz hands. Sing your, your cats. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, Alex. Go ahead. <laughs> Uh, yeah, and then they introduce themselves, and they sing their names, and then they sing their names again. And then they and then, sing their names. And then they sing their names and again. And then a new group comes by, and then they sing their names. And then there's like an evil cat, McCavity, and then he's bad. He's trying to go to heaven, too, but he's trying to get there by like stealing his way to heaven. Or but his- eliminating the competition. Yeah. yeah. And then out of fucking nowhere, he makes a cat evaporate into dust, and I'm like, holy shit, this Thanos. shit just got real. But yeah. no, it, no, he didn't kill it. He put it... On, on a, a barge. barge? How the fuck did you did you do that? Did I do that? Magic. I didn't magic. Do that. Ma- magic. Magic. Okay, so there's magical yeah. cats He's in the universe. Devil. There is magical cats, yeah. Okay. And then uh, then they sing their names again, <laughs> and they audition <laughs> by singing their names and telling their story, uh-huh. and then one gets voted to heaven, and that's it. And and then the evil cat has an introduction by Taylor Swift, who sings his name. Yeah. Yes. And then he sings his name. Then he sings his name. And then he sings his name for the old cat. Yes, Ju- Deuter- Judy, Deuteronomy. Deuteronomy. Judy- yeah, Judy Dench is Deuteronomy. Judy, Judy Dench is Deuteronomy. <laughs> what the hell? Yeah. And she's the one that gets to pick the most so awesome bad. cat. The one the most deserving to be resurrected. Okay. And put him in a balloon. And you go to and a balloon. And then kill the cat and by, the by cat. just putting the cat. You can't be resurrected in unless you're dead, Joe. That's kind of a prerequisite. <laughs> so what? Go. That's fucking put him terrible. Put balloon. And then you're you, going to space. They go to space and, and you die. I not, thought I thought the balloon's going to pop and they die. <laughs> I thought the cat that was going to be resurrected or was going to win the thing. Victoria? And she was going to speak her truth, as they say. Uh, the white cat. Victoria. Well, she wasn't Victoria. officially a jellical cat at the time. And she's brand new, so she doesn't deserve to be resurrected. Now, where, where did Jell- she came at the beginning. She gets dropped off by a big she's old abandoned. car. Yeah, yeah, she's like abandoned. So. Like, Get on out of here, cat. But yeah. I don't know who would abandon her because this actress is absolutely. People are evil, man. They don't want cats. Beautiful. I could stop staring at her face. And she's beautiful. Is this? 
Jasmine from Aladdin? No. Uh, kind of looks uh, like Jasmine. Francesca. She's a ballet dancer. Mm-hmm. Oh, just this is like her debut or something. Yeah. She's like, okay, I well, she. I hope I see her in more because, uh, you know, she did her job of looking curious and, being and beautiful a ba- yeah, being a ballet and being dancer. a ballerina dancer and then doing this weird she shoulder could, thing all she the could time dance. Ooh, do, 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 do. <laughs> that's better most of he's them. remembering all of the songs yeah, it's, it's incredible sure that's, you like it? yeah i'm pretty sure like you know all the songs by heart like i've seen it. <laughs> i don't know man i think you liked it more than yeah. we did yeah, yeah. Just because the, don't give you me that shit. You remember the dance moves. You know the song. That, that you know the song. Oh, yeah. they really did this in, yeah. in there, huh? Yeah, they did. Joe, no. They yeah, they did. did. They moved around they all nimbly, bimbly. And, and, they, and then they do. do. <laughs> yeah, they did that. It was real weird. <laughs> okay. So, no, Joe. Yeah, you know what? It's poison. It's poison to my mind. Yeah. I'm supposed to it's be like thinking more there. top 10 reasons why star wars is a fucking disaster but this, is this, disaster. this will give you perspective though but i tell yeah. you what at least this made me stop thinking about that for a second because i was yeah. in awe i was in terror Re- rebel whatever Wilson. she scares the shit out of me as a cat and then we have a big f- top hat fat cat i don't know who that po- james corden oh, oh right right yeah. james corden and uh i mean and they were eating food and out of the trash. It was real and weird. And then this thing was crazy, guys. It I, was supposed to be funny. It was not funny. Anymore. You got. I mean, you got to admit the dedication to the the training they were put through was weird. Oh yeah, they uh, Idris Elba tweeted that they were required to like get in their little body suits, <laughs> then crawl around the ground for like seven to ten minutes to you know just be cats for a little while, just, like you know do sniff know. butts and rub <laughs> up on each other, and it's like what the <laughs> hell? <laughs> that's, a, that's what this theater shit is, you know? They fucking they get in they, and then they evolve into cats, and they go from human beings into cats because they're supposed to be cats. Are they cats on screen? I'll tell you what. They move in very, uh, you know, low-key, sexual, horny <laughs> ways, and <laughs> it's very un- creepy and cringy, it and is. I don't like it. Yeah, like I said, it, it did feel like someone just has, like, a real w- weird fetish. They're like, I need, a, like, $100 million to make this movie, and I want all of these really attractive people to be in it, and I'm going to dress them up as cats. I and cannot believe we're going to play I... with feet, and we're going to do all sorts of weird shit. I cannot believe Idris Elba did this. Me yeah, either. Seeing Idris well, Elba... Ian... But he didn't really. He didn't do too much of the the the, the fucking. Dance. He did a little bit. He did oh, a actually, bit. yeah, he did, he did have end. his dance beat at the end. All right. Yeah. Well, I'll tell you what. Okay, so uh, here's the parts that I hated, all of it, <laughs> yeah. and I wanted it to end, and I was like, "What the fuck?" And <laughs> I was <laughs> bored. And I was air- bored. How could you be bored? In this, but that's what I was saying myself. I'm like, in the review, I'm yeah. going to have to say I'm bored. But yet, when you look on screen, it's impossible to be bored because of what's happening. And it's so, you know, hellish to look yeah. at. Yeah, because honestly, I don't know if you saw me halfway through. It was like, well, I'm going to go get myself another beer. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you yeah, went for yeah. a beer. I knew better. I got two when we yeah. walked in. Yeah. yeah. Um, God damn. It was no okay. Beer. I did like two parts. I'm going to tell you the two parts that I liked. Uh Part one is the railway cat. He starts tap dancing. Mm -hmm. And I love tap dancing. I'm just a tap dancing fan Mm. because it reminded me of the old school, you know, um, just, you know, the the, the guys that tap dance and and they put a big production on and they really show you their skills and then usually it's one guy versus another guy and then they it just it's fucking awesome and i love the beats you know that come from mm-hmm. the you know the, the the metal on the tap shoes and i was like i like this part mm-hmm. it kind of makes sense too cuz he's a railway cat so he's you know tapping on the railway cat and so his song and his routine was was fun uh, and it actually felt like a dance, you know. Most of the time, when these cats are dancing in a musical, I suppose they're supposed to be great music and dancing. Mm-hmm. And I didn't feel like the dancing was dancing in this. I felt gyrating. like the dancing was just sexually gyrating your ass and your thighs and and making your feet do the pointy and making your hands do this. Lying down and kicking and, one leg up in the air to uh, go spread eagle. Uh, uh, it's it's yeah. Even Judy Dench. 
goes spread eagle up in the air with her leg. I'm like, oh, help me. Yeah. It's yeah. like, what are you doing, Jesus. Judy? No. It, it, and so that failed for me. And the one good part was the dance resembled real dances of the the golden age in, yeah. in movies. And I was like, okay, I like that. And then um, the other part that I liked that actually was I was looking at and it interested me in a, in a plot way where I found myself, you know, looking at the screen was Mr. Uh, Mitzel. M- Mistopheles. Mis- Mistopheles. Magic Mr. The magic Mr. Mistopheles where he's he's unsure of himself. Then he needs to rescue the Judy Dench. Yeah. Uh, Deuteronomy and and I'm like this is at this point I'm like what is does he have magic or do only certain cats have magic and so I was like is he gonna get magic is he gonna disappoint everybody so I was involved for maybe ten minutes of the movie and he kept doing it, oh, and, he did it. and he didn't do it he didn't do it yeah. and then all of a sudden you see, you hear her singing and he turns around and she's there and I'm like. All right. <laughs> you didn't like that right. song? Like Ian, Ma- Ian McKellen when he was doing his little thing? No, no. I liked Ian McKellen. Yeah. And I liked the idea of his character, but I didn't like the song. It was too hard to follow. And it didn't really give enough of that. I was a badass back in the day. Oh, and I still have a little bit of yeah. it. It's just some lightning goes on in the background, but it's like you didn't but do he, that. But he didn't even do that. And yeah. it's yeah, lighting, okay, and I was well, like... Well, that's why he didn't win. You should have made him more badass, because he was like, you know, the only good actor. And well, well, I mean, Judy. I guess there's other good actors. Yeah. But, you know, you know what I mean. I was just like, I know him. This Gandalf. That's Gandalf. <laughs> Oh, and my God. God. <laughs> he drowned a cat. Yeah, there was murder. He's like drinking from the bowl, looking all sad. He's like, like, what the hell is okay. happening? And now I'll tell you uh, uh, the worst part of the film for me. Everything else? It, well, <laughs> yes, by default. But I fucking hated the glamour cat. I hated all the glamour cat parts because the whole time I'm like, why the fuck is she so sad? Oh, the whole game. <laughs> and I'm like, why are her? you doing this? And 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 not it's only an that, not only that, but there's a younger cat. Yeah. That's a female cat that's constantly like, <laughs> like hissing at her and wanting her to leave. And it's the same cat. I think most of the cats don't really have a problem with her, but it's just one bitch that has a problem with the glamour cat. And I'm like, somebody fucking kick that bitch yeah. out. So tell me, Alex. What is going on with a glamour cat? Why is she always sad? And why is she by herself? So she was horribly miscast, right? Because she's supposed to be like much older. She's she's supposed to be like really beautiful yeah, back in the day. She was not old. And she's, she's not old. She's not supposed to be beautiful or old. Well, she was young and beautiful. Yeah, yeah. It was it was dumb. And so it, in her early life, apparently at one point she did something with McCavity, like ran off with him or something. And so everyone hates her. That's why she's the outcast. And so okay. she's constantly reminiscing on like she used to be beautiful, like she's happy in her memories, but she's really sad now. And that's why she gets chosen but they did a terrible job because you're not supposed to cast someone who's young i believe everyone who ever played her in in broadway was either much older yeah. or they made her to look a like little the, bit older m- much because older. when you make her to look young and beautiful and 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 you know talented and at her prime is what it seemed to me yeah, she was just an outcast i was like oh so it's a competition of who's like the most talented and i was thinking okay maybe this white cat at the end victoria right yeah uh will will do her song and speak her truth and then she will get selected at the end but no it's the glamour cat because she sings memory and everybody likes memory everyone likes that song so then we she gets to ascend and die i i was telling oj that memory is you know the darth vader so you better scene? start talking more the, the Darth Vader scene in Rogue oh, One. This is your thing. This is your thing. What did you say in the car? I was like, you better say. I'm sorry, Alex. Go. Go ahead. The, you you know the the up. Darth Vader scene in Rogue One. Uh, memory is that for old white ladies, where it just like gets them amped because it's just like, oh, I remember back there in the was, day. There was nobody in our theater. No, except for one old white lady. And uh, to be honest, I was talking uh, a little bit. I was like, what the fuck is going on? Well, it's because I was so confused, and we thought she was going to murder me. Yeah. (laughs) Oh, yeah. It's like, you can't talk during this song. This is like the battle cry. That's her Rocky song. Yeah, seriously. She will kill you. She wasn't doing the whole fucking song. Anyways, so... So that's that's that song. Yeah, so, but the, I think she whole, was just miscast. Yeah, the whole thing with the CGI was terrible. But it was, it was empty. very inconsistent with like oh, also the garbage. feet. Like 
Are the cats supposed to be wearing shoes? Some of them are wearing shoes. Some They're of them are barefoot. Sneakers, some of them have like paws. Converse. And then they have five like, toes, you know, in a I human know. shape. And I was like, are you going to do cat paws or not? Some of them did have cat paws. No. Yeah, you, one or two. All of the feet I saw were human feet. Well, that's why they said they're going to redo everything. This week, they're re-releasing the film with fixed CGI. Because they right, take yeah, it down. you they need rushed to us to the down. film. <laughs> Alex rushed us to the film because we, had to we see were going to get, yes. we were going to have to see a, a cat's 2.0. No, cat's no. 1.7. I want to see if Wild's messed up. What are the, the fucking patch notes on that shit? But I guess we saw the original with the with the janky CGI. And to be honest. I don't know. <clears throat> Maybe it's because my vision is not as good as y'all's and that it was mostly at night. But there were only a few moments where we had a little bit of floaty face syndrome. The but for the lie. most part, I was like, I don't really see why you would need to update this. Other films are much worse CGI. They probably just need to take it down. Instead of yeah, put it down. <laughs> it's too old. Put it down. Ramp, ramp. Put it out of its misery. misery. It's run its course. Ramp put that the cat CGI down. down? No, put the no, put, film put down. the whole film down. So Take Cats 2.0 is literally dead cats on the screen? <laughs> That's great, guys. <laughs> Awesome. And then, like, just not show it ever again. Yeah. There was a lot of floating faces in, uh, not in the like in the primary characters in the center of the screen, but if you look to the side, their faces were like wrong. Uh, they were floating too, because when they were on the, they were walking on the ground. It looked like they were like, hovering above yeah, the ground. Yeah, that too. Uh, and it's she's like going off the steps. You see, you're just like. It's like, are you are you flying? Is it because you're dead and you're in purgatory, or is it just because you don't know how to do CG? Okay, and Joe. Joe, who's your favorite character? And your the best magician, part? obviously, because I love magic. That's the only thing I fucking liked from <laughs> so you this like film. You like that part? Everything else I hated. I, I love musicals. This I would never see again. <laughs> this should have stayed in Broadway. Do not bring it up to the movies. Now, Joe. had these awkward pauses. Okay, before I ask you your rating, because I'm going to save that for your okay. rating, what you told me in the car. Uh, Alex, what, what was your favorite part? Shut <laughs> your face. You love. Shut up. You said, I like cats. I. Uh, no, he you saw, saw the cats. Broadway. Well, why yeah, the Broadway? I mean, I like Memory. Memory's a good song. It's like an earworm, okay. and it's and it's good. But everything else about this movie was weird and bad. <laughs> like I hated Rebel Wilson. I hated as James you, Corden. A, as you talk through your whiskers and your cat ears. Yeah, well, that <laughs> yeah. Look, these aren't on by choice. All why right? didn't you put black on your nose, fool? Oh, I did. You did, you did a, a little tiny bit. little. Oh. Yeah. Thank you. You're supposed to have a big one like this, and you you're supposed to go that's... CGI, and you're supposed to put fur on the side of your head. CGI. Oh, yeah, there you go, Joe. Yeah, you're going to like be awkwardly right, let's gyrating. Give, <laughs> let's give this thing a, a, a final rating. What a poorly excuse yes. for a bunch of withing or writhing around and, and one or two good songs and 17 terrible ones that don't really count as songs. Just because I talk while I sing doesn't make it an instant awesome song. <laughs> I but you agree with like, that That's 100%. a whole fucking fail, man. I give this shit to Joe. What is your rating? My rating for this is going to be a two. I'd rather see Holmes and Watson again than this. Oh, I do not wait, want to see wait. this. Where does Holmes the second and Watson? Point? You'd rather see Holmes and Watson yeah. than Cat. Yes. If I had to choose from these two, I would Dude, rather see that again. Terrible this was, fucking The humor film. was horrible. I was bored all the way through. Yeah. The only thing that I liked was a magician. The other point is the movie worked. It, <laughs> It's not broken. The movie played on yeah, screen. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> But that's oh about it. Everything else God. was like super boring. It should have just stayed in, um, like I said, in the Broadway. Oh, like, I love musicals, but this is like. You love musicals. Yeah. Prove it. Which ones do you like? Give me top three, uh, or just give me three. I'll give you, you like. some uh, of the ones I like. Uh, I like Moulin Rouge. I like Rocky Horror. I like The Rocket Man, which is also a new one. Mm -hmm. Across the Universe. Are oh, you talking about movie musicals? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, Those I are saw all great. some Broadway ones okay. too. But. Yeah. Alex. Uh, like Broadway musicals, like Avenue Q, Book of Mormon. Those ones are really great. I mean, I like Les Mis. Uh, even That's even with too. even with Russell Crowe a little bit, like it was fine I if you tolerate him. So that was, was best. So that film is much yes. better. Yeah, it was amazing. Yes. That one was amazing, was like a masterpiece. This compared to ruins this one. musicals for me. I already don't like them. You took me to this, and now I fucking <laughs> hate musicals. And I'm like, see, I fucking knew it. It's just an excuse for for debauchery and <laughs> shittiness and cringe factors and 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 the the worst part well, of like theater I, I said, attitude this is the worst this, yeah this is this okay is, this 
is the worst thing I've seen this year. Like, not, not close. The worst thing I've seen this year. Okay, and go. go this is worse. This is, is worse rating? than Holmes, Holmes and Watson. <laughs> this is like it, it. It not only didn't make it was boring and it was yeah. horrible, but they had Jokes all failed. all of the CG was bad the worst and was poor. film of the year for sure that i've seen i can't think of anything i've seen that's worse than this was holmes and watson january yeah it was january february it was, i think it was january i think uh, wasn't it last year didn't they try to dump it off i looked that up when i'm giving my rating so th- this this movie is terrible i didn't like almost any of the characters i think they did everything poorly i think they cast people wrong and the movie Yes, it played, but it, you're watching it. You're like, this looks unfinished, and it's so unfinished. They're re-releasing it within the first week. Yeah. And the, the biggest thing that I can let you people at home know how bad this movie is: we saw it in the Dollar Theater four days after its launch. Yes. We saw it in the Dollar Theater today. Movie. No, that's not fair. That Dollar Theater was pay- that Dollar Theater paid top dollar to have that oh, two cats. So we paid her. two dollars. No, it's uh, what I'm saying is it's not already <laughs> dropped to Dollar Theaters. It's that Dollar Theater paid up to get cats because they thought it would be like. Why would you think? But they didn't... also paid up to get Rise of the Skywalker too. Okay, you that saw that? Sure. Oh, I didn't. Sure. Sure. But we so still I paid what two dollars? Yeah, yeah. No, we didn't pay two dollars. We paid full price. I paid full price. I buy all the movie reviews. <laughs> Oh. And and I was there's a total waste of money. Do not go see it. Dollar if theater. you if you hate your friends, trick your friends into going and laughing. Okay, so the, Holmes laughing. and Watson was December twentieth. Yeah, I thought so. So that was that fi- that year's worst film. And I'm gonna go with my rating. What was your rating? Two, two, two out of ten. Two out of ten. Yeah. I'm gonna go one, one out of fucking ten. Because I don't like musicals already, unless they're the premium premium of musicals. It was memories. so cringy. It was miscast. There was no fucking plot. None of it made sense. It was terrible to look at. Rebel was playing with herself on screen. So was Judy Dent. Jason Drillo was Why? sucking toes. Idris Elba had embarrassed himself. And I liked, I give it one for the tap dancing. And because Joe likes magic, maybe I can give it a two, <laughs> but I never want to see this again. Never, right? And you've ruined Cats. Now I'm, I'm, I'm like, I was curious because Cats was that Broadway where, oh, everybody saw it, and Go then it, cats. it ended, and you can't see Cats anymore. Thank so God. now I was you like, see why. whoa, I can see it. <laughs> And I won, and I saw it, and I'm like, you son of a bitch. <sighs> I need some holiday cheer. Yeah. I'm going to switch from cats to some, some uh, holiday cheer. Guys, Merry Christmas. Have a, a happy holidays, uh, and thank you for Please avoid this movie making me watch costs, this shit. <laughs> unless you don't like your friends. Uh, we just wanted to torture him. <clears throat> Honestly, yeah, it was, did super, me. I'm it was losing super my fun. voice, motherfucker. He does it because you're singing so he much. He does it to us. So it's like it's only That's fair true. we do it to him yeah. at least once. All right, <laughs> memory's gonna be stuck in your head for a week. It yeah. is. And so, then the Jellicle song. No, damn y'all, Jellicles. I hate Jellicles. What the fuck is a Jellicle anyway? Do you even remember all the factions of cats? Jellicles and. Uh, Jellicles. They're well, all Jellicles. Ray cats and fuck them. <laughs> <laughs> that's what Joe says. Okay, guys, that's it. Thank you so much for watching. And we'll s- no spoiler section for this. No. Uh, the spoiler everything. section is this. Uh, the cat that wins the big prize dies in the end because <laughs> it flies off in a balloon. And then eventually the cat is going to fall off. Balloon and pops and, ball, and the cat falls. Pops. Cat dies. Yeah. Uh, Idris Elba was a villain. He should have got his comeuppings, but instead he fell off. He tried to grab the... The balloon at the last minute, but then fell on a statue, and now he can't get down. So I guess he's gonna magic his way off it eventually because he's magic. Yeah, and, that's yeah. about it. And then, it, oh, my question <laughs> is, I was like, oh my, I was like, oh my god, I am going to vomit and and have nightmares if they showed what the dogs look like. Because oh, if yeah. this is what the cats look like, nice. <laughs> we saw a bunch of, we heard a bunch of barking. And I was like, oh, my God, are we going to see dogs? So my question to you guys, since you all know of cats and stuff, why did they never make a sequel like dogs? Right. (laughs) Because the big message of this film is a cat is not a dog. 
That that I don't I don't think I got that message. Yeah, that was the message. Oh, okay. All Judy Dench to heaven. Deuteronomy literally breaks the fourth wall and is staring at the audience and is trying to explain to you to go home to your cat and pet your cat yeah. because that's the only yeah, thing to take away cats. from this film because that's I mean that's the only good part is like oh I can't wait to well, go kiss my cat. I don't have a fucking cat. Yeah. Right. Well, and then she said we're not dogs and I was like yeah, well, yeah. no that. fucking duh. <laughs> You're not actually we cat either, Dinch. Thanks, thanks. But I, what happened to the dog sequel? Why did they never make a dog? Uh, I don't know. They maybe they ran out of because cocaine they and be, because they because <laughs> dogs don't do this. Because they just be licking themselves the entire time. <laughs> They were licking themselves. They like Jason Drew has a foot in his hand. He's going, ah, and then they pull it away at the last second. Yeah. See you guys. Weird shit. Angry Joe musical. Bye, guys. <laughs>